Hello there friends, it's Amanda here. It's my spring break this week, so I have been taking the time to do some spring cleaning. Um, top to bottom, this house has been cleaned. Today I've been doing some decluttering and organizing and making space for the baby and just getting everything done that I haven't had a chance to do. And something that has struck me during this process is that it never is done. It's never done. <laughs> I can do the dishes and then the next day we eat and I have to do the dishes again. Or I vacuum the carpet and I scrub the floors and Luke comes home from work and the carpet is muddy again. Or um, I vacuum and clean up all the dog hair and then the dog just walks by and everything's hairy again. It's a process that never ends and I'm sure everyone listening can relate to that. Um, and it got me thinking about how this relates to my relationship with the Lord. Um, I have a couple of verses for you here. Uh, Romans 12, which is probably my favorite chapter in the book. The Bible, <laughs> I mean. Um, <clears throat> so Romans 12 verse 2 says, Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, his good, pleasing, and perfect will. And then if we flip over to Ephesians, which we all know lots about Ephesians these days. Ephesians um, chapter 4, verse 22. You were taught with regard to your former way of life to put off your old self, which is being corrupted by its deceitful desires, to be made new in the attitude of your minds, and to put on the new self created to be like God in true righteousness and holiness. So our relationship with the Lord is about being transformed and becoming more and more like Jesus every day. And that is a process, just like house cleaning or chores or whatever, that is never ending. And maybe that's a little frustrating. I, I, I think sometimes we want the, the stuff in our lives, the, the gross, hard things or the things we struggle with to just disappear one day. And sometimes that does happen, but other times it's slow progress or it's daily progress. You get up and you have to remind yourself, okay, today I'm going to be more patient and this is how I'm going to do this today. Or today I'm going to do one thing that is loving toward my neighbor. And that's not something that's, that's a one and done. That is something that we have to strive for every single day to remind ourselves that God is transforming us and that's not a process that is that is ever finished and that um slowly we're being transformed and refined by god to become more and more like his son jesus and i think that's a really beautiful thing to remember that god is not finished with us and that there's always more work that can be done even though some days that might feel overwhelming and frustrating um but I just pray that we keep in mind that no matter how frustrating our day is, how many times we feel like we're learning the same thing over and over and over again, that God truly is not finished with us and that he is continuing to refine us and to make us more like him. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week and weekend and we'll see you online on Sunday.